Hello students, welcome to Wisdom Academy. I am Nastin and today we will be seeing acid, bases and salts. Okay. So we will be seeing what are acids, what are bases, salts and importantly we will be seeing indicators. Okay. So these are the three or four important topics we will be seeing here. Okay. First we will see what are acids, bases, neutral substance and where we will see in day to day life. Okay. 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 First acid pop okay la? so acid are the substance with sour taste okay so sour taste of a substance compare when the acid of brain solvang okay is a bitter taste in the on the pair when the basic substance base of brain wang okay wa? so sour taste mean acid basic me bitter means base right so then we have something called neutral neutral line are going on the acid on sour taste to recall the bitter taste to recall okay on the pair when the neutral substance of brain solvang so in the moon pair of another I mean the unit on the party capo acid base neutral okay if I'm going to pack up on a bina one day either one of the day to day life like a lot of mother's up or wrong like a lot of park or on park okay so first we have acidic acid so vinegar I'm a material as a vinegar lurker than the acidic acid so then and stinker I'm a girl 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 orange okay in the middle citrus fruit like the citric acid okay so then curd like the lactic as well you milk and all that and the word use panel so curd is called curd like acid with the lactic acid then spinach like the oxalic acid okay so then we have arm last it was full in or acid to go ask or because it ask or because nothing but vitamin C really yeah so I'm telling you the lemon level vitamin C you can solve on that is because it has Oscar because it okay next one tamarind pulley Tamarind is called tartaric acid. Okay, so these are all in our day-to-day life. Parkers, vegetables or some edible substance are like acids. Okay, acidic, formic, citric, lactic, oxalic, ascorbic, tartaric. Okay, that is the source of the source. If you look at these things, like tomato acid, then onion acid, different vegetables and fruits, you can check the acid. Okay. So then we go to base, okay. So base on the power lime water, okay, so number of principle, okay, I'll look at the calcium hydroxide, okay. So you can buy the OH in the area, the pair base of principle, okay. So lime water, we have calcium hydroxide, then we have soap, my soap, कुलीकर सुधिता जन साला और क्ले आलर के दोनों सोडियम हाइड्रोक्साइड और पोटैशियम हाइड्रोक्साइड तो सिंबल्स प्लीज लर्न K represents potassium, N A represents sodium, O represents oxygen, H represents hydrogen. Okay, so इधर मैं chemical represent symbols ना try to study. Okay, so soap लड़कर द बंदे हाइड अदूम soap is also basic in nature. Potassium hydroxide, sodium hydroxide. Okay, then milk of magnesia. Okay, इधर example ना उन्होंने बोल रहा है, अपना मास बोल रहा है. So milk of magnesia अंदर है, magnesium hydroxide. So milk of magnesia. Okay, so magnesium hydroxide. This is all in our day-to-day life. We have acids, we have bases. Vegetables, fruits, we have acid. But this is soap, lime water, milk of magnesia. This is our body. So we have to use soap. So this is all in our base. Okay, then we have what are salts. Salts are the salt. Okay, so salt 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 are the salt. But we can taste the soap and taste the soap and taste the soap. We cannot taste everything. Okay. So, what I'm doing is visually, I'm checking the acid or base. That's why I'm doing the chemical substance or some substance. And the substance is called indicators. Indicators. This is a substance which indicates whether the substance is acidic, basic or neutral okay so this is my solar substance give the indicators up in solo okay so indicators and other one then I'm coming session la park so now we are going to see indicators okay so first to the natural indicators papo then we have one artificial indicator also okay so first we'll start with litmus okay either number adding ma one the simple I use panna because the number with me solution I will make panna tavala normal litmus paper in a mug on the karek on looking la so first the litmus nana they are they are obtained from a species called lichen okay so lichen and silver on the lichen wanga lichen wanga you know pronounce panic la so okay algae and fungi say in the care of the compare the lichen of green wanga chilling la so the lichen in the derive extract panda the litmus okay so and the lichen end up and now either the extraction and the extraction edit the solution formula you are going or as a solution a paper dip and you're done the paper compare litmus paper up in one okay solution formula you're going paper formula you're going to see no paper form I use for no okay well 
So, the extraction of lichen is called litmus. We have in solution form also in paper form. Paper form, you ready to And the solution la paper dip pani vekkanu. Okay, la? so this is called litmus paper. So, now we will go how they react. Okay, neutral substance, no color change. Adi eppidi irukko, apde edha irukko. Okay, acid will turn into red. Base will turn into blue. Oh, litmus paper red color vandha, adi pair vandha acidi. Blue color vandha, it indicates the substance is base. Okay, inla? so next we will go with this regarding litmus. So, red color means acid, blue color means base. Okay, then we will go for turmeric. Okay, so turmeric we will use panta. Okay, turmeric we will use panta. Okay, there is a substance called curcumin. Okay, the curcumin substance are the turmeric the color. Okay, and the color use panta mena panta pura indicator of park pura. So, now how can you convert indicator this? Take a pinch of turmeric, dissolve in water, make into paste. Turmeric paste okay? and turmeric paste and paper and paper soak and dry. Okay? That paper is called now indicator. Okay? So, with neutral and acidic, it remains as yellow. Okay? Neutral and acidic substance is yellow color. But the base turns into red. Okay? Suppose most of the dress is yellow, turmeric partition, soap put to wash it, red color because soap, can, soap is a base. Just now we saw potassium hydroxide, sodium hydroxide found in soap. Because of the soap base present in soap, it turns into red in color. Okay, so acid and neutral are yellow, base means red. Okay, so this is our second indicator. Next one is China rose. This is ready for China rose or petals. And the petals end up in the tunnel, and the wash pani. And the tunnel end up in the pella extra on the water. Okay, now we will use water. Okay, so acid is dark pink color. Base la the green color, varu. neutral la the dark yellow color. So these are three colors. Acid means dark pink, base means green, neutral means dark yellow. Okay. So then we have phenolphthalein. Okay. Phenolphthalein is an artificial indicator. Artificial na lab la namble prepare pando. Okay. Ingla. Ida vande base orda se se it gives a beautiful pink color. But with acid and uh, neutral substance it is colorless. Apo phenolphthalein add pani pink color vanda base. Pink varla na it may be acidic or neutral. So, these are four types of indicator. Okay. So, litmus, acid means red, base means blue, turmeric base is red, acid neutral is yellow, china, acid is dark pink, base is green, neutral is dark yellow. Okay. So, then phenolphthalein, base is pink, other substances are colorless. So, now we are going to see Now, I will give you some example. Okay, so I will give examples. Okay, and the example of the litmus, sorry, and then the indicator, the color change. Okay, we take HCL. Okay, then I am taking NaOH. Then I am taking sugar. The three solutions formula. Okay, HCL is acidic, NaOH is a base, sugar is neutral substance. Okay, first we take litmus. Litmus HCl means it will give HCl is acid, hence it gives red in, red color paper. Base means it gives blue. Sugar means no color change. So next one is turmeric. Turmeric acid yellow. Be, with base it gives red color. Neutral means again yellow. Okay. So then we go for China rose. China rose acidic is dark pink, basic is green, okay, neutral is dark yellow. Okay, big since sugar is a neutral, we have to write a neutral test. Then phenolphthalein. With phenolphthalein colorless, colorless, this one will become sorry, this is become pink and this will be colorless. So, in the end, the substance is first we have to check whether it is acidic, basic, or neutral. After checking it, you have to put, if litmus is given, okay, and litmus, when you do, uh, check with litmus paper, the substance is giving blue color litmus paper means the substance is base. But checking with China rose, China rose solution is turning into green color means the substance is again base. Okay, phenolphthalein is giving colorless means it may be acidic or Neutral. So, in the morning, what is the color? And the color is the acid or base on check. Okay, the problem with phenolphthalein and turmeric is phenolphthalein and turmeric are the basic color change. Acid and neutral are the same. Okay, but we use litmus and china rose. Use. Litmus and china rose are the same. Different colors. So, 
So, this is the indicators use for the substance of acidic, base and neutral. So, this is the application. Okay? So, now we are going to see acid drain. So, if you look at the rain, you can see acid drain. Acid drain is what you can see. Okay? So, you can see all the pollution. So, air pollution, water pollution, soil pollution. Now, consider air pollution. What is air pollution? Some unwanted substance is being released into the atmosphere by use of vehicles, industries, etc. So, what is the unwanted material? Gas, carbon dioxide, sulfur dioxide, nitrogen dioxide, and gas. Okay, so, so air, atmosphere gas is in the atmosphere mal layer is deposited. Correct? So, what is the earth surface? This is the mal cloud. Okay, now what is the key to the gases? CO2, SO2, NO2, different different gases. Okay, in the gases, the cloud is the key to the cloud. Okay, now what is the cloud? Now, rain is the form of the cloud. So, strike is the form of the rain. Now, what is the rain produced? Now, the rain is the water. Okay, the water is the first thing to react. Because the cloud is the key to the cloud. We have gases, air pollutants. Now, the water, rain water will react with the gases. React with the gases. Suppose I take rain water, it reacts with CO2. It forms carbonic acid. Okay, I take SO2. Water reacts with SO2, forms sulfurous acid. Okay, then NO2. It reacts with NO2 and forms nitric acid okay la so in the acid vandu sorry in the rain vandu the key laga gases air pollutants kula react manasana i get different different acid see acid na romba strong ah la irukadu adla konja dilute ah romba mild ah na condition la acidic irukum seringla so ipo enna avuna in the rain key la earth surface ku varumbodhu enna avuna avanga varum andha villa drops of full acid content irukum so they have acidic content, they are not neutral. Water is supposed to be neutral. Water is supposed to be neutral. Okay, wow. But it will be not neutral. It is less than 7. Now, let's see. What is it? Less than 7. So, we have acid rain means the rain water will mix with the air pollutants. It contains some acidic content also. That is called acid rain. Now, what is the problem? See, we are very big living beings okay so we don't have problem but what about the microorganisms plant sea animals small small animals okay wow. so angle one day in the acidic condition on by effect one okay so plant effect as now we are also get affected because we depend on plants okay the food decline of a plant mother depend there correct so so this is the problem with acidic green it don't much number of animals number can the skin look on the problem for long but adding my effect are the plants Plants and microorganisms and small living organisms. Okay, so this is the problem with acidic rain. So now, what we do is air pollution. We stop it because everything is caused by this pollution, pollutant. Okay, so if we stop it, then the rain will be acidic. It will be a neutral substance. Okay, so this is regarding acidic rain. The rain reacts with the air pollutant. It forms acidic in nature. This is called acid rain. Okay. So, in this session, we will see the things we have seen here is what is acid, what is base, what is neutral substance and where day to day life where we can see the substances. Then we have seen indicators, natural indicators, litmus, turmeric, china rose and we have seen one artificial that is phenophrine. Then we have seen acid rain. In the coming session, we will be seeing neutralization reaction and where we can use the neutralization reaction. So, like the video, subscribe to our channel, share with your friends.